Hello viewers, PNK94 here. Welcome back to The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. Last time, we got to- we went into the Volcano Summit, and then we had to bring a giant water basin here, and had to go through most of Elden Volcano again, for some reason, because apparently Fi couldn't tell him. Scrapper, by the way, for those of you who weren't paying attention, or were just tuning in on this episode for some reason. Yeah, we couldn't have just told him we were going to the summit. No, we had to start from the very bo bottom, and then I got lost, and then we got here, and anyway, we're going in. Welcome to the Fire Sanctuary. You know, it's funny, of all the dungeons in the game, I don't remember what the boss here is. I have an idea. I do have an idea on what it is. And I think I might be right, but I'm not going to say anything to prevent spoilers. So, let's- Oh my god, I just jumped into the fire. <laughs> don't do that. Do not jump into the fire, it's not very safe. Um, do we whip things? I'm not actually sure what to do here. Uh, let's see. Ah! We're making water drop. That's what we gotta do. So, um, no, we can actually use the claw shots. So we can save on arrows. You don't wanna waste arrows. Arrows are always nice to hold on to. Hearts! Yay! If you're more skilled than I, you don't need to waste an adventure slot. Adventure pouch slots on the heart metal, but that's why people are probably better than I. Because they would be like, no, we don't need no hearts, dude. We got this, but I'd rather have the hearts. Honestly. Um let's see. Got a dig spot here. I also got my bottles back, don't remember if I showed that! Got a fairy. Yay! Yep. Do you, do, you, do, you, do any of you actually just use fairies to heal and not to give you a second life? Because I never just have them heal me. Uh, anyway, so we got past that. I think that's a lizard Wait, I mean, that's not a lizard Fulse. It's just a bow dude. We'll deal with him later. So get you. For this to stop moving. And jump. Let's see. You want to get off here or no? Not quite. We do, however, want to start shooting these guys. Whoops. Ow, my face! My face! You dick! Ah, I just hit my keyboard tray. Ah, okay. This is our stop. But, aha! My face! That arrow just flew right into the face. That's a dude. Hold on. I have a plan. Eh. Okay, he does not have a horn. Ah! Uh. Yeah. Okay. You know what? Let's try this. I'm gonna block everything else. Block that. Yeah. That's what I thought. Bitch. Okay. We, uh, we opened a chest thing. I mean, not chest thing, it's just a chest. Let's get that. Do we get a key? Assuming we get a key, because there's nowhere else we can go. Yeah! I got a silver key. There's also vines over there. Is that important? Let's find out. I also like how, in a lot of ways, the whip is largely made useless by the claw shots. It's just like, okay, you had the whip, it was useful for that one dungeon, and then maybe a few other places now, it's like we're just gonna put vines everywhere. Hi. Ho ho ho! Ah! He exited at last. Whoa! Don't scare me like that, I thought you were one of those monster creeps. Oh hey, what's this? You got yourself a swanky pair of digging mitts, don't you? Who are you anyway? What you doing here? Well... Hmm, I get you. Huh? Me? Oh yeah, the name's Gold. I'm the big boss of the Mogwas. Those digging mitts you got right there, I invented them. Ha <laughs> ha! <laughs> 
No offense, pal, but you don't look like the kind of guy I'd send in here on a treasure hunting mission. But what do I know? You might just surprise me. So here's the deal. Word in the tunnels is there's a huge treasure hidden in these here ruins. But nobody who's ever seen it has come back to tell the tale. How do you know they've seen it, then? Countless treasure hunters have disappeared in here. Poof! Gone! As a treasure digger, I gotta warn you to just turn around and enjoy the many peaceful years of digging left to you, but... You're gonna do this no matter what I say, aren't ya? Pretty much. Alright then, I'm gonna let you in on an ancient treasure hunting legend passed down among generations of magmas. Every magma worth a handful of dirt knows this one. Here we go. <clears throat> you who seek the entrance to the king's treasure, look for the two statues that face one another. Show your bravery and, jumping in, and jump into the mouth of the sleeping statue. Do this and the path will open before you. You remember all that? And you're golden. Thanks. Something about statues and jumping into a mouth. Got it. So all my guys are searching around here for the treasure. If you get lost, holler at one of them. Oh, so you're going to tell me not to look for it, but you still have guys searching for the treasure. I see how it is. Nothing in the grass. Let's go. Oh, we're outside again. Neat. Oh, damn. Well, that doesn't look like anything with two statues facing each other. That just looks like a giant-ass door. And that looks like a dude. Let's try this one. Ah! Well, the whip's good for something, at least. Killing these keys. Ah! We actually did come across some back in the, uh, climb back up the volcano. I think that was cut out of the episode, though, because that was just a lot of that stuff that was kind of unnecessary. Yes! No reinforcements for you, bitch. All right. Bring it. Ha-ha! I don't need arrows. I should have been doing that sooner, because that's actually really effective, as you might have noticed there. I wonder how well to work on the lizard pulse. I need to charge the gamepad. Uh-oh. Hold on, I got this. Oh, come here, thingy. Okay. Boom. Not nearly as time-consuming. As that one time in that one episode, because I was prepared this time, because I didn't just move into this place. Okay. Uh, so we got this way that goes down, or we can go this way, which is not down. Well, I'm glad we started with this way. What do we get? Red rupee. Dude, I can't spend... I mean, I have to spend it all in one place. It's getting expensive. And that's arrows that I probably should have saved. Oh, well. It'd be a crime not to check all of the pots. I mean, this is a Zelda game. Though, as I say that, I'm sure there have been instances where I have not checked all the pots. This looks like a mini-boss area. I'm, I'm expecting a mini-boss here. Um, do I want to jump down? Probably, but what's this? That looks like I could just shoot it, but do I want to shoot it? I mean, maybe? Oops. Yeah, that's not really helping. Alright, um... What's this? Ah! We want to get on this thing. Oh my god! So, do I need you to come up below this, or like, what are we doing here? Ah, yes, okay. That's all that that required. So now, we got, wait, pots. Can I have pots? More arrows. Okay, I should stop breaking the pots, they're just giving me arrows. Uh. So, shit. Oh no, is they've called reinforced. There's like nobody else even showing up. Okay, let's go ahead and shoot these guys, just to get them dealt with. Um, there. Shit. No. Saw nothing. So we're dead now. But you can't see nothing. Oh, wait. That's not what I meant. 
Close enough. Uh, I've been playing a lot of Fire Emblem Awakening again. On my third playthrough now. Lunatic. First four chapters are kind of tough. Then you get past that, and they will be grind and stuff. It's like, oh, this is so much better. Um, that looks like where I came from? No, wait, I came from down there, right? Yeah. Yeah, so we go down here. There's a thing right there. Of course, all of the fires. There's nothing on the ceiling, is there? No. Uh, let's see about that. Not very useful to us yet. And a door! Door it is! That's a Dynaphos. Okay, he dodges the Skyward Strike. Oh my god! Really? Okay, seriously? That is not the fucking direction I slashed! Still is just a lizard tail. So not any different than the ones you get from the Lizifals. I'm not even sure that those guys are stronger than the regular Lizifals. They might be. I was pretty sure we were supposed to fight them in this circle area, but I kind of let them run at me so we couldn't do that. <laughs> Whatever. I fight where I want to on my own terms, damn it. Again, dude, you are literally thinner than those bars. Just walk between them, Link. Ah, uh, I mean, if you're gonna have bars blocking off an area, don't make them so wide apart where your character could fit through them. It's just, just so bad. It's just so bad looking. It's like, dude. It's like in cartoons where it's like, oh no, they're in a prison cell. It's like, they're practically fitting between the bars already. What's the issue? You know? So bad. I think we might actually need a beetle up there in a second. Ow! Stop it! He shot me as he was about to die. Fantastic. Okay. I think we're actually about to get some beetle use here, as I said a moment ago. Um, let's see. We can, we can knock that down. That's not really on a current, though. Do we want to knock this down? I would assume so. I don't think it's gonna go anywhere because we're not on a current or anything. Yeah, I'm not sure what the point of that was. Um, wait, there's something down there. Is that gonna melt? That's melting. Okay, but is there anything down there? No. No, I think we need to, like, make this flow or something. Is a... Oh, we need to blow that up. I think we'll need to get bombs or something with our beetle. Okay, first, let's see. Beetle. I see another tunnel right here as well. Let's try this first. Oh god. Okay, trying this first. Let's see, we got okay, there's some bombs. There we go. Uh, anything else up here? It's kinda of cool. And there's also this tunnel over here. Beetle's probably not gonna make it all the way through, because this is not an upgraded beetle. Um let's see. Oh no, it's making it. Okay. Ropes, 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 yes. I'm honestly surprised it's only just now starting to cut off, though. That's kind of awesome. Alright. Let's go in from this side now. Uh, where's that? Right here. I'm going to grab this bomb. There we go. We want to get those rupees, too. Boom. Now we can start a current. Or, now we have a current started. So we can use the thingies to get some platform. That's not a lot of water for such a big platform, though, if you really think about it. Alright, let's get those rupees, because they are there. And we want rupees. There we go. Now... Shots to save arrows. Excellent. <laughs> I think as long as it's moving, it's not going to melt as fast or anything, so we're good. We don't have a key. 
Oh, there's a door here. Okay. I was worried for a second there. Well, that's not good. That stuff looks hot! I wouldn't mind a little hot bath for my sore shoulders, but this is too much. Hey. What have we got here? Another new guard? Ha! You can't break me with interrogation, son. You'll never make me talk. I'm not some sideshow for you to gawk at. Get lost! Chew now! So, he's over lava. Um, it's gonna hurt me. Yes! Yes, it is! Oh, dear God! <laughs> oh, wow. Okay, so we need to cool this stuff off somehow. Oh, wait, if I go over here, can I get back? Um, I'll think about that in a second. First, is there anything else we can do before I go in there? No, because it's all covered with lava. There's the hands in there, though. Gotta deal with those. And let's do some treasure chest. If this is the key, I'm gonna be kind of sad. Oh, it's the key. But we gotta go save the dude, so we gotta do something in here still, because we can't get back without burning. Actually, no, we just can't get back at all. There's dust here. Anything is fun. A green rupee. And... A green rupee. What a waste of time. So... Wait, how do I get back out of here, though? I sure as hell can't... Wait a minute. Ah! I see. The claw shot target was a distraction. Is he gonna, like, fall down and burn if I do this? Oh, no, it's just kind of there next to him. Okay, it's not actually affecting anything. Alright, so there we go. We cleaned up the lava rock or whatever with the gust bellows. I'm not sure how that works. I'm really not sure how that works. Okay, so we actually can't do anything here yet. We got our key, though. Okay, bye. I'll be back later. Probably. And what is behind key door number two? Otherwise known as a locked door. Which is the proper term for a door that requires a key to open. Because it's locked and stuff. I know what I meant, I think. I have taken a lot of damage already. Mostly from being shot at. So yeah, I'm not really sure what the point of having that over here is. I can't however dig this. That's good. Ow! Really? Like, really? That's just rude. I'm low enough on health as it is. God. That was supposed to hit all of them, but that didn't really happen. Alright, um, can I get some hearts, maybe? I would love some hearts right now. Uh, I think I just had an idea. I totally just had an idea. Ah! You're not the idea! But I do have an idea. I think shoot these guys from over here. Just to deal with them ahead of time. Aw, oh, man, I was hoping there'd be, like, fire arrows or something. That would've been awesome. Okay, so my idea... I'm gonna get around these real quick. Let's see what's in here. More rupees. And Elden Ore. Wait, stop. There's still more to dig? There is still more to dig? Yeah, yeah, Elden Ore, which I have 28 of now. Thanks for the introduction again, game. Oh my god. Uh, I think towards the start of this, I needed a bunch of that. Or maybe not towards the start of this, like in my... No, not that one, not that one. There we go. Um, okay, let's do you. And Ruby! Not particularly worth it. I guess it kind of is. <gasps> ah, I meant to get away from it. Okay, whatever. No, stop target. No, stop it! Stop it! Just turn the fucking camera. Please. Ah! There we go. You. Uh -oh. I wish there was only one, I see. Um. Hmm. Okay, my idea 
was to use the beetle or something, but I'm starting to think maybe that's not what we're supposed to do. Because it almost looks like I'm supposed to pick one of those up and throw it at the thing, but I, I can't pick those up. They'll poke me. So what? Okay, um, hmm, like I stand here. Okay, cool. There's that. Fi, any suggestions? Uh-huh. Oh. Are you sure that's formed by magic? That is, I mean, I guess they do kind of move on their own slight. That was like a target if I've ever seen one. Okay, stop targeting the things. But I'd say that looks like a target. Okay, I stand corrected. That is not at all a target. Okay, I'm lost again. Um, oh my god. I'm stupid. I'm stupid. These things, if you stab them, they will attach to your sword. There we go. Problem solved. Alright. That problem is now solved. Uh, hi. Okay. Let's see. So now that we get past that, finally. Ah, uh, man. We are now... Fucked. Oh, this will be fun. Oh, this will be so fun. Fight me! I dare thee! Goodbye! Oh no, I do have to, I actually have to kill them. I actually have to kill them, don't I? Did that do anything? Yes. Okay, there we go. That's all we had to do. That's all we had to do. Whoops. Okay. Come back down. Do, 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 do. There we go. And... There we go. Easy enough. Super easy, actually. So now that we've done that... Yeah, that lower door we can go through. And we helped that dude. Hey! I was watching you, pal. You really sucked into those lava thingers. Amazing stuff. And if you don't mind doing one more thing while you're at it, how about you get me down from here? I'll be right over. You think like down there? Yes, there will be stuff down there. Neat. I wonder if we'll have like any way to kill the one that was in that other room. I mean, that one did was kind of necessary for traversing places, but you never know. Okay, so do I just like do this from below? Yeah, yeah, there we go. It'll be that thing. So, got all these, all of which are empty. I see. Just got a locked door over there. Some other stuff. Hmm, another one of the ones that just becomes a hole. Hmm. Let's go on you. Wait, they had the switch under the lava? How did they even... Okay. Oh yeah! I'm saved! I don't know who you are or where you're from, but I owe you a big time. Are you here looking for treasure too? Yep. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> you were totally caught up in that too, pal. I can see it on your face. You're here because of the legend of the sleeping statue, right? But those are some busted old digging mitts. You can't go using them for treasure hunting. I got it. As thanks, I'm going to give you a replacement pair for my secret stash. Don't you go nowhere. Um, five years later. All yours. They've been in a buried treasure chest, so they ain't dirty or anything. Now, these ain't the kind of thing that you can easily get your hands on just anywhere, so take good care of them. Right then. I'm out of here. So long. Okay, thanks. Bye. You got the magma mitts! Even the magma don't see digging mitts this fancy very often. They don't just dig holes, they also let you burrow your way under the ground, try to find holes that you can dig down into. 
So those pits that we've been seeing, 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 seeing that are holes like this, the digging spots that become holes like this, we can go underground with them, which we will show in the next episode. So, if you guys like this and want to see more Skyward Sword, make sure to let me know in the comments below if you have suggestions for other games you might like to see once this is over. Also, let me know in the comments below. So make sure to like and for subscribing, all that good stuff. Till next time, this has been PMK94, and I'll see you guys in the next episode.